welcome to Real Estate in Fort Wayne and Northeastern Indiana. We're still talking on the purchase agreement. We're talking inspections today. The contract says that a buyer can actually waive the inspection, but we highly suggest that you do have that to protect yourselves as a buyer. Then it will say that the buyer shall have so many days, and we fill in a number after the agreement is accepted in order to have these inspections. There's another area that after we have those inspections, if we need more inspections to further investigate, that we can put a number of additional days that we have in order to complete those additional inspections. Major defects. A major defect is the only reason that a buyer may terminate a contract. That is, if the seller will not fix the major defect, then the buyer has the right to terminate the agreement. Then it goes into limited home warranties. A home warranty covers the buyer for one year from closing. It covers the mechanicals, which are the heating, the air conditioning, electrical, covers appliances. It doesn't cover roof, anything on the exterior or windows, but it does cover a lot of items on the interior of the home. And for $399 to about $475, these warranties will cost, it is worth having one. Now, they also have a deductible, but it is worth having that, especially if you're buying an older home. Then we talk about disclosures. You should have the seller's residential real estate sales disclosure form. You should have that signed, which says from the seller, the condition of the property on the date that you made the purchase agreement. It is not a warranty. It's just saying to the best of their knowledge, this is the condition of the property. Next week, we'll talk about title insurance and title approval. So we see you next week at Real Estate in Fort Wayne and Northeastern Indiana.